All right, everybody, welcome back to Eyewitness News. Take a look. Today is a big, important day when it comes to meteorology. We have a groundhog do it for us. And he came out of his hole, looked at no shadow, which meant only four more weeks of winter, which means it's an early spring. To find out more about it, we send you guys now out live to Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania, where I sent my twin brother, who lives pretty close to that area, uh, and uh, you drove all the way out there to, to see the groundhog come out. What was it like? That's right. Uh, it, it is a great day here in Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania. It was, ex it was a wonderful experience. Got to take my son out of school to come and experience it firsthand. And uh, we got to see the, uh, the governors and the senators and the mayors all come down with their top hats and open up with the magic stick. Uh, Poxitani Phil, as he announced that there is no, uh, no extra days of winter. And uh, I, I felt, though, as I was here, I felt like I've lived it two, three, four, five, seven times already today. Uh, something happens on Groundhog Day. It seems like you experience it more often than you should. Joshua, let me ask you this. So you, you have tons of people there. Uh, we were looking at video of it. Uh, how many people were there and what was the excitement like on the ground? Yeah, several thousand people were there uh, easily. Um, around 6.30, they do a huge firework display uh, with incredible music in the background. Everybody's chanting, Phil, 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 Phil. Let's see if we can do that right here with those who are taking pictures. Ready? Phil, 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 Phil. Okay, well, right, 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 right now. But... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you gotta the, the town was growing crazy early on and uh and samuel adams they had uh that for beer so maybe that had people going crazy or, or whatnot but uh it was awesome it was exciting i really i want to take my family next year uh everybody together uh and uh it's i even got a special interview i have a special interview for uh eyewitness news with uh the senator, Jim, uh, here in Pennsylvania. And the senator, and so he's the guy, get, let me ask you this, he's the guy with the top hat and who pulled out Punxsutawney Phil? He was one of the gentlemen with the top hat uh, that pull, pulled him out. And, and uh, he has a special, they're going to be uh, a special Phil ride that's going to happen uh, year-round uh, beginning, I believe, next month here in Pennsylvania. Uh, so it was, it was quite exciting. Joshua, so hopefully you get that video here soon. Let me ask you this, so... Technically, Puxatani, his accuracy is 40%. As a weather forecaster myself, that's not a great accuracy. Do you find people that were there when he yelled it was going to be an early spring? Did, do you think people were saying, did you hear people say, that's not going to be true? I mean, what was the, the sentiment? Were they excited about an early spring or did they really believe in Puxatani? People wanted a longer winter. Okay, people wanted a longer winter. I, I think, honestly... I don't know about you weathermen, but uh, I, I think he was probably spot on. If he was wrong most of the time, <laughs> that that sounds about right, don't you think? <laughs> it does sound about right. I want to ask you, since you're, you, we got a perspective from your point of view, is, is Zachariah there, your your son? We get a, a, a child's you know, perspective? He is, it, honestly, it is so cold here. It is very cold here. Uh, he His feet got wet uh, walking up the uh, Nob Nobbler's Hill there. And, uh, uh, so he is in the car, uh, being heated up right now. Um, ah. and so, yeah, it, uh, but he, honestly, he enjoyed it. It was, it was a blast. We got to actually, ironically, we got to walk down with the, uh, uh, mayor and everybody that you see on the screen there. It was, uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, I got to go up front and, uh, got to go see Phil, um, in that, uh, experience. So, well, that's great. Uh, by the way, as I, as I watch your video, I, I see us in there. That's pretty cool. Uh, right on. <laughs> All right. Well, once again, four more weeks of winter. Uh, the people there wanted a longer winter. You get a shorter one is what we're going to see. We here in Kern County have rainfall. And I just want to tell you, uh, in Kern County, Joshua, we celebrate um, Ground Fog Day. If Kern Clyde sees his shadow, that means we have two more weeks left a fog. If he doesn't, it's four more weeks. And because of our clouds, it is four more weeks left of fog season. And that's because it, it rained here for us. But man, we really appreciate you going out there and celebrating Groundhog Day for, for 
everybody here in Kern County, and of course for you guys doing it for the first time. Well, it was a blast, and the, and the senator out here invited all of you guys to join us next year out here. All right. Well, maybe we shall. Maybe we shall. All right, Joshua Perlman, live from Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania. We appreciate it. And, yes, we are identical uh, twins. Yes, you, you are a good-looking guy. You're a good-looking guy. All right.